In between stocks. <laughs> All right. I hope you guys like Poo Stick and uh, the Pokemon Stadium. Uh, it was close. Oh, d so Dark Horse um, not going Pikachu. I feel like I haven't seen a lot of uh, anything but Pikachu from him this uh, this season. This season. Oh, GT. Oh, he gets it with another up tilt. I like it. He just needs to get an edge guard. Dark Horse doesn't have a lot of options here. Ooh, nice down air. It's, it seems really difficult for Jigglypuff to recover on this stage. Um, I mean, most characters' cover recoveries are severely limited by the lack of platforms. Um, Pikachu... His only options are going for the the ledge and an unsafe landing on stage. Puff um, really can't go anywhere unless she's high enough to get over a uh, stick double jump. Oh, I thought. You, did you play him already? Oh, okay. See you guys. All right, Dark and GT, uh, Puff, Pika. I feel like the other week, maybe not last week, but a couple, one of the most one of the recent weeks, uh, GT actually took a game off Dark on Final Destination. Maybe one of the stages, Middle Cavern might have been. But uh, I don't remember which character Dark went and which character GT went. But I feel like one of these uh, 19xx stages played in his favor. So it's interesting to see how some characters and some play styles can change depending on these. That was actually a really good rest by Dark. Just reading where Pika's landing, because there's no ledges to cancel on. Pika has to get in the sweet spot, or they just sit there like a, like waiting to die because the landing lag for Pika's so bad that you can just get a free rest or something. That was, that was good by Dark. Dark one, uh, up one. Uh, going to Metal Cavern. Dark switches to Pika. Uh, Leotard Pika. Oh, good down tilt. Good up tilts. Nice patience. Nice up tilt up there. Back here. All right, just uh, forward smash ledge. Edge guard. Or up tilt works there too. They're gonna have a somewhat stale back here though, so it's not gonna be as effective in killing as you would like. Um, forward smash. You know, you can ledge the eye, but on this stage, there are not really many places to go. GT having some control here. I think maybe it was Metal Cavern he won on. Um, almost a full stock lead here. Looking to put it up there. Oh, he misses the up here, so there's a good down there by Dark. So GT up, but two stocks on Dark Horse. And uh, it doesn't need the thunder there, so it gets the kill. posting now in 64 Hill trying to 
Twitter whore himself out there. All right, Dark looking to tie it back up. Good forward smash. He tied it back up. You got an edge guard down here. Dark solid at the sweet spots for you know for picking up Pika pretty early, pretty recently. And it's not going to kill. The stage is too high of a ceiling. But GT gets it there. Oh, good up air. Oh, GT! Oh, baby! Oh, you gotta deal with low angle forwards out there to cover that edge. When you land too far in on your recovery and you want to counter out your Pika and he's at a distance where he needs at the ledge, uh, low angle forward tilt comes out the fastest and it hangs out a while, so it's one of your better options. Um, down tilt solid, but forward smash takes way too long. Dark trying to do the Derek, but it doesn't. I don't know how that works on the stage. Oh, that up tilt. GT reading dark. He knows he's going to go over that sweet spot every time, so he just goes, hey, I'm just going to up tilt him. GT been uh, practicing a lot, coming out to a lot of tournaments. Out to Shine. Made, uh, I think it's 17th to Shine, maybe top 16, maybe on 13th. Um, so he's been really working hard, studying the game, practicing. Coming out, playing, really ambitious and trying to improve. And he's doing pretty good here against Dark's Pika. He's, you know, Dark, Dark's got a, always got a good neutral, always got a good punish game, always makes good reads. So even if it's a character he doesn't play as much, like you know, his Pikachu versus his, instead of like a Puff Falcon or, or something, he's still going to be pretty good. Uh, and that was a weird down smash hit on the other end. And the back throw, I don't know if it would have killed because uh, Meta Carbon's pretty far, but uh, Dark didn't feel like he was going to make it back. Uh, Might have been true. Could have maybe got it back, but it seemed like it, GT would got edge guard, and it might have actually killed. We don't know the percents yet, but uh, middle, ca middle cavern is wider boundaries, so whether or not it would have definitely killed, Dark was probably losing that game anyway. So we're going to game three. The 19XX has played in GT's favor, um, on at least keeping the sets close with Dark, but he hasn't won one yet. Dork! Dork kills himself there. And they're playing five stocks. I don't know what kind of game, which, which city they're in, but this will be a four stock game. Uh, but they did five in the set, so this all the games that have to be five stocks from here. Uh, interesting choice for Dark to come here. The shield break? No. You're going to get such short kills on this stage. And, uh... I don't know. I mean, I guess back throw for Jiggly would kill early, but it's not like rest is going to be like any more effective. I don't, I don't really know why I would pick could opt for Jigglypuff on this stage. I don't think there's much of an advantage that he gains. The back though does kill earlier, but that's about it. And, and he, what did yes! he, he knocked him out! Yo, he knocked him out and he rested him! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> He completely messes up with the up B, and then it actually turns into his favor, and he still gets the rest off. <laughs> yeah, knocked him out and raped him with the. Or I can't say that on thing. He knocked him out and then took advantage of him in his sleep. <laughs> Is that gonna kill? Nah, the the ceilings actually kind of short on this stage, but it's not like unbelievably short. Not like the sides are. And a four throw kill. So GT up a stock. Oh, 
Oh, and the counter. Nice. DI's down. Make sure he gets the tech earlier before uh, you know GT can follow up with the up tilt and then punishes the rest. That was actually, we saw that done um, not on stream. So anyone who wasn't there kind of missed out. But we saw that happen at uh, Apex 2015, Killer Y-Bomb. And uh, another one that he missed. And that's another. Now a GT up a stock here. Uh, this is game three. Um, No, one of them, at, oh, the, the sing, I think you meant. <laughs> it, definitely played, it, definitely, it definitely paid off. <laughs> oh, this is going to be tough for GT. Ooh, no. This is anyone's game, but it's probably Dark's there. No, back throw, kill him. No. They did the I by GT, but that's not going to be enough. Um, so Dark takes it, game three. Next up we'll have, I guess, Yo, me and Bark, I guess? I don't know.